Yes, I'm the one behind Nam the Kano's continuous stay in detention. Boris speaks, comes out fully, revealed the real person behind Nam the Kano's detention. <laughs> oh my God! You see, when I'm telling some persons something that look, this is the person that is behind this, they will say no, that it's a lie. That is this person. Bari is playing a face off. He doesn't want anybody to take cognizance or you know be not be uh, or notice that he is the person he is the person behind nam the cannot stay in detention he doesn't want anybody to know so that is what he is doing and that is why you see that he is hiding himself he is hiding himself so my dear listeners we just have to be watchful let's check the content this is a morning news. President Mohamed Buhari has said that Nam the Kano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOF, will never be granted bail. Speaking, he decided to speak on Nam the Kano's continuous stay in detention, revealing and saying that he is the one behind Nam the Kano's continuous stay. And if possible, we extend his stay in extension in detention. There is no reason for releasing Namikano because there is no single sign of change. I am not even ready, and I don't think I will be ready. Namikano's plan is to be released and return back to his own self. He is not ready to change. So, since he's not ready to change, then he will stay and die in detention. I, President Mokwari, have been the one behind his continuous stay in detention and no other person. What is the difference? Nam de Kanu is a criminal, and a criminal deserves to stay in detention and to rot in detention. Who knows what's going to be the next hearing? I bet you. Nam the Kano's next hearing may be sending him to jail. And that's all. That's all. Very speaking, I've said that there is already move to get Nam the Kano away from detention to a nearby prison. If care is not taken, he threatens. Mr. President, <clears throat> um, anything you want to do, you, you can do. That's what I would just say. Because you are not I, uh, speaking it clearly, I will tell you that you are not being fair. You are too partisan for my liking. Though, that's why I, I just look and laugh at those people that are, you know, giving you credit. Giving you credit by praising you for uh, for what you've done and what you... see there is nothing you did you never did anything some person will say that uh, uh Buari actually favored the southeast more than the southwest what are you talking about if you know what Buari did to the southeast you will not be saying what you are saying he constructed uh, the, the second niger bridge is that the only thing needed to be done in the southeast? What he destroyed in the southeast is more than what he did in the southeast. Bori is a corny man. He's a corny man. You know what he's doing? He's cunningly trying to get the southeast Islamized. That is what you don't know. Bori is cunningly planning to get the South East Islamized. Come on. He can't, he, 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 can't, he can't continue to be lying to us because we are not fools. Because we are not fools. We know everything. 
We are aware of everything. So let us reveal the truth to ourselves. Let us tell ourselves the humble truth. And let the devil be ashamed. Mr. President doesn't have any good plan for you. You understand? Look at what he said. Listen to him talk. So, my dear people, for it not to look as if we don't know what we are saying, I will encourage every IPOP member Every beer friends. Oh my god. See, I don't know if any beer friend is in this channel. Eh? Me that is doing this broadcast, I'm not a beer friend. No. I am not. And I'm not even an evil. But I it is paining me when I see the way the evils have been treated. It is paining me when I see the way. They have been maltreated. Buari has been unfair to the Igbos, most especially to the Biafrans. These guys are only fighting for their rights. So why are you denying it to them? Come on. See, it's not a question of because I'm the Yoruba, I've been because I'm the, the Hausa. You understand? Why lie? I, I'm telling you that. Buhari has not been fair to the Igbos. He knows that Nnamdi Kanu is the only solution to the problem of the Igbos. He knows that Nnamdi Kanu knows the truth. And that is why he quickly kicked Nnamdi Kanu down. Look at what he did when he came to power. Why is it that the moment Buhari came to power, that is when he knows that he's going to get the hyper prescribed? Why? If he doesn't have that intention of getting the South East Islamized. Oh, shit. My listeners, let us watch carefully all the moves that President Mob has been taking. Then you will understand the area that I am coming from. And then you say thank you. I am not, I, I, I am not trying to be, to be partisan. I am only trying to be just and realistic here. I'm not saying that because I, I, I'm not saying that I, I, I am supporting the Biafra so I'm supporting the Igbos. I'm just telling you the reality that Buhari have not been fair to the Igbos. He has been unfair to them. Very, very unfair. And it's not okay. Let's take the content. Let's hear from you, my dear listeners. Let me know the area that you are also coming from to know what your own take an idea could be. Don't forget to leave them below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.